So right now, I am going to make a demo on how to update the firmware version of uh, Nikon Colpex P700. So from menu options, I go to settings and format the memory card. So all images will be deleted. So that's it. Okay. So that's it. The memory card is empty. So from there, uh, I need to remove the card. So on my uh, computer, I go to the Nikon website which uh, below. Uh, leave the description. So from the Nikon website, which is the download center. I scroll down and uh, wait. Uh, software, firmware. So I click the view download page. So I scroll down, and this is the end user license agreement. So from there, you will accept the terms and click the download. Icon. So right now the files was downloading. So we will wait. So it's finished. No, uh, we will uh, create a new folder so that it will be easy for uh, trace up. Uh, I make a folder from the desktop. So that the downloaded files will put up there. So here we go. File with uh, XC format, so double click and it will uh, automatically in zip files which is uh, in subfolder. So from there, uh, uh, insert the memory card which is empty to the memory card slot of your computer or laptop. So I just mm, open a new window in order for me to copy the files from the desktop. So what you are going to do is to drag and drop or copy and paste. The left window is the desktop window and the right side is the memory window. So it is really easy. So right there. So it's already finished, so I close the, the windows and uh remove or eject the memory so I put it back into my camera and then go to main option then settings and from version so update new firmware from version 1.2 to version 1.3 then click yes So it will take uh, minutes to finish.
so it's done. So no, please note that uh, there's a no turn camera to complete the update. So just shut down the camera and for a second. Turn it on. So that uh, you will see the, the latest version in the settings. The firmware version is the already 1.3. So I successfully updated. So right now I am going to delete the files from the memory card. Again, take note that uh, I delete the files from the memory card using my computer or laptop so that it will not pop up again. So that's it. Thank you for watching.